Here on Martha's Vineyard in Massachusetts, we found an 81-year-old mystery writer named Cynthia Riggs. Divorced with the kids long gone, Cynthia took up mystery writing as a hobby 15 years ago. As you can see, she has a prolific imagination. But her best story is her own true tale, a tale of romance and intrigue that began last year when she got a strange envelope in the mail. I'm always looking for sort of wonderful mysteries, and this, this, this seemed to be one. And there's this one white card in there. One white card. What was on this card? Well, I, the card was in code. A coded message. But what did it say? There was no key for breaking the code, or even a return address for that matter. But Cynthia was pretty sure who sent it. She says 60 years earlier, she was working at a marine laboratory in San Diego when she made friends with a young co-worker named Howard Atterbury. Did you send that? Yes, I'm, I'm the one responsible for that. Why? What Howard eventually told me was that he and Cynthia used to pass notes in the lab, coded notes, which he saved. It was a simple substitution code where A equals B, B equals C, and so on. Cynthia says the notes were just innocent banter. I would say something like, did you see that Don found a copepod in his sample? Is that, is that flirting in no, marine biology circles? Flirting. No, I liked him a lot, but I, I didn't see any romantic interest in it. Howard says he knew she felt that way, which is why he never asked her out. Later, he got married to someone else, divorced, stayed single for a long time, until the age of 90, when he finally got the courage to tell Cynthia what he really felt. And what did that note say? It said, uh, I've never stopped loving you. After Cynthia translated the message, she tracked him down and flew out to California to see him. Howard proposed an hour later. They got married last month. For Cynthia, it's a new unexpected chapter in her life. For Howard, a 60-year dream come true. I honor you. I honor you. You know, love is a great place to spend the rest of your life. <laughs> okay.